known to their Alteran creators as Astria Porter and to the Goa Old Empire as Chapa I. Stargates are hyper-advanced superconducting rings, capable of harnessing any source of energy and applying it to create and maintain stable wormholes for the purpose of interplanetary travel. Designed by the Alteran scientist Amelius, dozens of millions of years before the rise of the Tau Ri, a standard Stargate is 6.7 metres in diameter and features nine prominent chevrons, essential to the gate dialing procedure. Original first-generation Stargates are only partially comprised of Naquida and require a time-consuming dial sequence to activate. The later second-generation gate is comprised entirely of Naquida, making the device incredibly resilient, but resulting in a colossal blast should the gate ever be successfully destroyed. The final third-generation of Stargates was developed by the remaining Ancients who became known as Lanteans, and featured a rapid dialing sequence that could be completed in a short few seconds. The first seven of a Stargate's chevrons and glyphs are used to isolate the location of another gate and establish a wormhole connection. Chevrons 1 through 6 are used to designate points in space and form three-dimensional coordinates for their destination, while the seventh chevron is coded to the Stargate's current position to provide a point of origin for the wormhole. The eighth and near-mythical ninth chevrons of the Stargate were a mystery to the Tau Ri and the rest of the galaxy for many years. Ultimately, it was discovered that with sufficient power, an eight chevron address could be used to jump to another galaxy, connecting to an entirely different galactic network of stargates. The mystery of the ninth chevron was finally solved by the Tauri Icarus project over a decade after Stargate Command was founded, revealing that the sole nine chevron address in existence could be used to dial the original Stargate prototype aboard the ancient starship Destiny, wherever in the universe it might be, using vast amounts of power to establish a barely stable wormhole over literally any distance. Objects and individuals are only able to travel through a Stargate in the direction it was established, attempting to enter an incoming wormhole or making contact with the initial wave of energy projected by an activating gate will result in instantaneous disintegration. An exception to this can be found in the form of radio waves, which can be sent in both directions through an active wormhole. Almost all Stargates are operated by a fixed console located near to the gate itself. This is known by the Tau Ri as a dial home device. DHDs use a cluster of control crystals to wirelessly communicate with the Stargate and transmit the necessary glyphs for each dialing sequence. The Earth Gate at Stargate Command uses a custom-built dialing computer in absence of the original DHD, and while this does result in lower memory and computational speeds, it has also allowed the device to resist computer viruses tailored for DHDs. An object or individual exiting a Stargate requires at least a small amount of space in order to materialize properly. This has led numerous powers to develop security systems which take advantage of this. Certain Lantian installations such as Atlantis, feature powerful force fields projected over the event horizon of the wormhole, and this technique was later adopted in a more primitive form by the Goa Uld Empire. The Tau Ri took a simple mechanical approach to this system, installing a retractable titanium barrier known as an iris that was later reinforced with Naquida trinium alloy for increased resilience. So long as matter or energy continues to flow through it, a stargate can remain open under its own power for 38 minutes. After this time has elapsed, colossal supplies of external power are needed to maintain the wormhole. In the case of orbital space gates and Ori super gates, black holes are often used to provide a ceaseless power supply and maintain a wormhole permanently. The effect of the Stargate on galactic history cannot be overstated. The Milky Way network alone has guided the development of countless spacefaring nations over millions of years and allowed for simple travel between dozens of worlds without the use of spacecraft. Even long after the extinction of its Alteran creators, the gate network continues to serve a vital role in most galactic civilization, facilitating the peaceful expansion of some races and the violent subjugation of others.